Hi everybody, I'm Lauren. And I'm Seth. And today we're in San Salvador, the capital city of El Salvador. And this country uses the US dollar. And there are a ton of markets here, so we're gonna go through today and show you what eight US dollars can get you in the markets of San Salvador. Yep, I'm excited guys, let's do it. One thing that's cool here guys is it's so common to get the dollar coins. They're everywhere here. You don't see them nearly as much in the US, but very common here. All right guys, this is off to an awesome start. Our masks were getting kind of crusty and old. Yeah, so we literally got a whole new pack of masks, like so many, for one dollar. One dollar, let me see how many is in here. 50 face masks for one dollar guys, that's crazy. That's wild. Wow. Well, you wanna put one on? Yeah. Put a fresh one on. By the way, we are not doing any type of bartering or negotiating. We're just buying stuff at listed price. Well, who would have known, guys? It's 2022, and you most definitely need these everywhere you go, yeah. especially if you're traveling. So, yeah. $1. Sucks, but it's a part of life right now. A lot of places require them to come in. All right, we got our fresh face mask on, and we're going to keep going and looking for more stuff to buy. $7 left. All right guys, so we just got 30 jicotes for $1 and these are amazing fruits. They're called the king of fruits here in El Salvador because they have a ton of health benefits. They actually help you lose weight because they're really high in fiber. So if you eat them in between meals, it feels like you're more full and they're extremely healthy for your immune system and they're a natural energizer. So you don't need that caffeine. You don't need the uh, energy drink. You just need a jicote. Mm. <laughs> Muy bueno. Wow, guys. So this next one is a bag of coconut skin and water, which he cut right in front of us for a dollar and 25 cents. So good. Mm. Delicious. Yeah, guys, this is so refreshing on a hot day. It's 90 some degrees today. Oh yeah, that's fresh. That is so good. And I'm obsessed with coconut, so I literally can't wait to eat the skin. <laughs> yeah. Guys, one note though, it's definitely good to have smaller bills here. Uh, a 50 or 100 is probably gonna get rejected most Ooh. everywhere, but even a 20 is a little much. Try to have as many 10s, 5s, as you can. And gold dollars as yeah. possible. Gold dollars are fun to use. I don't know why we don't use them more in the US. I know, it's, it's crazy. Really but here, you, you basically get them in every transaction. Yeah, all the time. All right, guys, so we spent 325 so far, and we have 475 left. Lauren, you sure you don't want these? These are only $1. Oh, those are nice. <laughs> Is that seriously only $1? Oh, $1, yeah, see. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Gracias, Dios. Gracias. All right, guys, as much as I love the coconut in the bag, nothing beats natural water on a hot day. And you can find the bags of water everywhere. They're served cold and they're typically about 15 cents. We paid 15 cents for this here. You just bite the side of it off. I still make a mess. I'm not good at it yet. And then you can just drink it. Un dollar? Gracias. All right guys, so I just got a pair of shorts in the market for one dollar. These are like some workout shorts. Tell them what they are, the booty shorts. <laughs> <laughs> booty shorts I guess <laughs> but anyways it's gonna be nice to work out in these and if you're in need of clothes there are tons of clothes in the market here that are super affordable definitely more affordable than the um, shopping malls that are in town all right guys it got really windy out here on us but we just got some pupusas these are like the national dish of El Salvador they're so famous here you can find them absolutely everywhere basically it's just beans and cheese inside of this thing right here you can either get it in rice or corn flour this is rice flour here you can get them everywhere. They're usually about between 20 and 50 cents each for these here. These are the biggest ones I've had so far and we pay 30 cents each for these. So 60 cents because we got two. And it comes with this vinegar slaw and salsa. You just tear a piece of them off and kind of just pinch up some of the uh, slaw and you're good to go. They're so, so good guys. 
Mm. Suburb. Very, 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 very hot. They're always made extremely fresh. The more you eat them though, the more your fingers get used to them. It's kind of like being a cook, but it is hot. And they're traditionally vegetarian. Now you can get other stuff in them like chicken, different kinds of meat. We usually just get beans and cheese, frijoles and queso. And yeah, we're good to go. But these are amazing. You cannot miss pupusas when you come to El Salvador. And you're not gonna miss them because they're literally sold everywhere, on every block, especially in the mornings. One dollar. Okay. Enjoy the weather. Thank you. This was only one dollar. Look how much you get. It looks heavy. It is, oh, it is heavy. heavy. Wow, it's cold. If you didn't know, it gets really hot here in San Salvador and just El Salvador in general. And so this is a great way to cool off another drink in a bag, but this time it's a strawberry like milkshake smoothie and he ground it up and blended it up right in front of us. And it's so cold and fresh. All right, guys, we have $2 left. Probably gonna find like, some hygiene products, some stuff we actually need to get, not just uh, stuff to keep eating and drinking. We wanted to make it really confusing guys we would also bring in uh bitcoin to this because bitcoin is actually the secondary currency here in el salvador and all all over the place you'll find places that accept bitcoin uh even in the market so that's pretty cool and we could really complicate things with that but we'll stick to the usd all right guys we're back at the hotel now uh the camera ran out of battery so we had to finish here but anyway we did finish the eight dollars but it was actually harder than we thought uh so i got this drink uh it's an energy drink here you can find in el salvador this is 50 cents we got three for one toothbrush you can't really have enough of that so this is one dollar and then we got uh coco pirated on dvd don't tell the feds on us but uh we can watch this on our laptop because uh, the Wi-Fi here is kind of slow, so we'll have something to watch on our laptop. But I've seen it before in English several times, so we'll get a good chance to practice our Spanish if it's just in Spanish. Uh, but yes, we got a pirated Cocoa DVD. You'll find pirated DVDs all over in the markets. Honestly, guys, that was a little bit difficult to finish. We didn't need anything else, and we were at like five, six dollars. Uh, so we just had a lot of drinks and a lot of food. That goes to show you that if you shop in the markets here, it can be very affordable. But disclaimer, honestly, if you're shopping in the stores or the malls or at the uh, international franchises, it's pretty much U.S. prices, a little bit less, but it can get a lot more expensive. But yeah, if you're shopping in the markets, you can really uh, get a lot of ink for your buck. I think the most impressive thing was really that box of masks for $1, 50 masks. That's crazy because I think the last time I saw in the U.S., what were those, like 7 to $10 a box. So that's pretty wild. But anyway, we're back at the hotel now. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Yep. Cheers, guys.